Hello. Welcome to the Valder Beebe Show. Happy New Year. Happy New Year. Happy New Year. Well, thank you for being here. We're live out of Dallas, Texas. I'm with my audience, you know. I'm going to speak to Jeremiah Robinson, and he brought Patty. We're going to have a great discussion this morning. Jeremiah, wheelchairs, walkers, and canes are essential for those with mobility impairment. Let's start there. What drove you to create uh, what's being called this innovative device for individuals with mobility impairment? Well, the, the mission is deeply personal for me. In 2010, my daughter was diagnosed with cerebral palsy, uh, which is a neurological condition that impairs her ability to walk. And for years, our family searched for solutions that would help her build strength and gain independence. Um, but like you said, found walkers, wheelchairs, and crutches. Uh, nothing had really changed um, in 100 years. So in 2018, I founded Psionic to really bring the best of technology to bear upon this challenge of mobility impairments, AI, sensing systems, and robotics to build a system that could continually monitor her movement and augment it in real time. I'm going to speak to Patty in maybe a, a, a more user-friendly way. Patty, as a patient, who uh, who uses psionic uh, neural sleep first? You use it firsthand. Could you tell us the impact it has on your day, daily life? Because the end user is sometimes uh, see a little bit different from the creator. Uh, yes, that, that can really be true. Uh, and since I've had multiple sclerosis for 33 years, I've had a lot of you know, different opportunities to try different devices or different treatment plans. And as a physical therapist for the past 48 years, I kind of have seen it all in terms of the technologies that were developed for, to help people with disabilities. And some of them have been great, you know, as far as bracing and, and types of wheelchairs. But this actually changes the what's going on inside me by having a sleeve, my nervous system is learning how to function better. I don't have to constantly be thinking about, okay, this is how you walk, Patty, take a bigger step, pick your foot up. The sleeve does a lot of that thinking for me and also stimulates the muscles. So more of the muscle cell gets recruited and starts helping me accomplish the task. So as the user um, I just feel much more confident when I walk, and it's been easy to apply to. When I first heard about it, I thought, "Well, that sounds different." I've, you know, but really, what it is is it's it's much like if you if someone had a knee sprain and you had a, a sleeve for your knee, but it's much more technologically complicated because it's way more uh, of a strengthening activity and a coordination enhancer than any kind of brace could ever be. So I've I've benefited from it remarkably because I've gone from being able to walk 10 minutes with trekking poles outside to walking 45 minutes or longer on uneven terrain. And I can participate in a lot of volunteer activities that I wouldn't have taken on uh, prior to having the sleeve. And I do my housework without a struggle anymore. Uh, I end up with, at the end of the day, not all fatigued because I haven't had to work so hard to walk. And that that makes that's a really life changing, game changing kind of experience when when you especially when you've been dealing with a disability for a long time. To hear your glowing report, thank you for sharing that, Jeremiah. You're the founder and the CEO of Cryonic. Tell me, what do you see AI doing for people like Patty in everyday life in the future? And so one of the big things that AI is able to do is to learn patterns. Um, and when we think about all of the different walking patterns, especially within people who have conditions like multiple sclerosis, stroke, cerebral palsy, or spinal cord injuries, each person is very unique. And so the algorithms that we employ basically adapt to the movement they have and the needs that they have to um, augment their movement. And so this is the big 
step forward. We can incorporate many more sensors than have ever been incorporated before, many more points of stimulation. So we have 24 electrodes within our system. They measure muscle activity. We have two motion sensors that measure the movement of the limbs through space. The algorithms can take all of that information, uh, understand what is happening within the body and what is needed to help uh, augment that movement pattern and then deliver electricity precisely and personalized to each individual to maximize their, uh, their mobility. This is so exciting to me, Jeremiah. I just wrapped up three days last week at the CES talking to uh, representatives there. And AI is such a focus in everything that we are walking into. I'm so glad you're a part of this. Where can we find more information about your company, Psionic? Yeah, you can go to the website, psionic.com. There's more information, uh, and you can hear from more of our users like Patty. Uh, take a short assessment and learn if Psionic is a good fit for your mobility needs. And then you can order directly from the website with a prescription from your primary care doctor or your neurologist. We will then ship the device directly to your home. And we have a team of mobility specialists who will set you up remotely through a Zoom chats uh, and uh, then follow along in your progress. It was important that we weren't just selling a device, but that we were providing a service to maximize mobility outcomes for all of our users. That is so great. Looks like you're bringing customer service back in style. I want to thank you and Patty both for stopping by the Valder Beebe Show and informing my listeners. This is your audience. My audience is made of a people born between 1946 and 1964. They're known as baby boomers, and they have a lot of things that probably fit into psionic. Thanks for being my guest on the Valder Beebe Show. I'm very proud. Thank you. Thank you so thank much you. for having us. Hi, I'm Valder Beebe, host of the Valder Beebe Show. We have over 1,000 videos on ValderBeebeShow.com and YouTube.com slash Show. We upload new videos daily. Our site is a modern baby boomer platform with news and information important to boomers. Subscribe to YouTube.com slash Show and stay connected as I interview the world's most fascinating people.